Hello, Matthew Judson, JSP Technical Director. Looking at full rest harnesses, one of the questions that we commonly get asked is how do we fit it? Well, it is really quite simple. So what we're going to do now is just give you a quick guide. It's not an extensive training guide, but just a quick guide on how to fit the harness. When you unpack it, it's going to be just a, a bunch of webbing. What you need to do is to grab the rear attachment point, locate the dorsal plate, put your hand arm through between the two straps so you've got the thing hanging nice and neatly. Make sure the leg straps are hanging down and then you're ready to fit the harness. What you want to do is put one arm through one side, lift it over the back of your head and then get your other arm through so that it sits down on the back. That's very important to make sure that the webbing sits nice and flat. So just reach around, make sure it's all there and untwisted. You can either start with the top attachment, the chest attachment, or with the legs first, whichever takes your fancy. We'll go with the legs. So pull the strap through, locate the attachment point around the side, and then simply push the fastener through and make sure it's seated down properly. Repeat with the other leg, put it through, and then just make sure you've got them sat nice and straight and no twists on it. Then attach the chest strap. Again, push through. Again, make sure it's sitting nice and neat. Now what you need to do is to make sure you've got the harness tight and snug fit. Because if you're gonna fall, you need to make sure the harness is on. So looking at the, uh, the, the leg straps, just pull those down. Get, make sure you've got a nice fit. When it's nice and comfy, just pull through. Put the keeper loops in place. Repeat on the other side. And there we go. Got a nice snug fitting harness. Very easy to get fitted. Next thing you've got to do is make sure you're working with a buddy and just get the buddy to look around and make sure that the dorsal plate is nicely in the back of your shoulder blades so that when you attach your, your lanyard to it, it's going to give you a nice secure fitting.